Hello everyone, it's 20 Italians and today we're going to be bringing you a new series. This is Long Live the Queen and I know what you're thinking. This has no place on the channel but I, I ask you to, to hold on to your disbeliefs and to hold on to your critiques until you to see everything. So the whole point of this game is to guide young uh, Elodie or Elodie and I'll say it either way, probably Elodi more often, um, to basically survive until her coronation as queen. Her mother has died, and she lives in a kingdom where the queen rules, and the kingdom, and the king is is off to the side. So uh, we need to educate young Elodi so that we can survive. And I'm going to tell you right now, it's not always going to work. This is our father, King Dowager, Duke of Calary. We're almost home. Your room is just the way you left it. I know it's hard to leave your school and all your friends, but I've arranged the best possible tutors for every subject. You have to work hard this year to prepare yourself before your 15th birthday, but I know you can do it. So we have one year. You'll learn quickly and you'll make a wonderful queen. It's what your mother would have wanted. This is not what mother would have wanted. She wouldn't have wanted to die and leave me. No. She wouldn't, but sometimes bad things happen. We have to pick up and carry on. All of Nova depends on us and on you. I'll be here to guide you until your coordination, but the decisions you make are ultimately up to you. Come, your maids are waiting. Alright, so I have played this before, so we're not going to go through it, and I'll tell you how the game works as we go. Basically, we have, we have 52 weeks. We have a year in order to survive and become queen. And we have to go to school along with doing other things or be tutored along with other things in order to gain knowledge, in order to uh, gain skills, in order to survive. Probably not going to happen. Lodi is affected by her, mood, by her moods. Uh, it gives buffs or it gives uh, negative impacts to some things that, that we do. So our current mood is depressed and we have a bonus to expression and animal handling and we have a penalty to royal demeanor, conversation, athletics. So we have no skills right now. Our outfits, our outfits can also change our moods, but so far we only have the boarding school outfit. So let's go to classes. In the morning class, remember, we have a negative to royal demeanor. We have a positive to expression. Mm, ba -ba 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 -ba. We'll start with expression with instrument. And then in the evening, we're going to do history. Or do we? Mm, ba -ba -ba -ba. Let's see what else we can do. Intrigue. Faith. Lore. Ah, the magical history of Nova. Sure. All right, so we are done. Let's go to class. You tap out chiming dyads on a glockenspiel, learning the basics of harmony and rhythm. Oh, good, we got 15. In the afternoon, only a lumen can channel magic, and only with the help of an attuned crystal. The ability to control a crystal seems to be inherited, so crystals can be passed from parent to child upon the lumen's death. Interesting. What's all that noise outside? Who's there? Oh, it's my cousins and my aunt and uncle. Lucille, Countess of Nix. Darling, we were so terribly sorry to hear about your mother, Fidelia. Oh, thank you. You look well, niece. That is Lauren, too. Looks kind of dour himself. Cheer up, bud. Hi, Lodi. It's Charlotte. Lady Merva. Hi, Lottie. I haven't seen you in ages. Will you be staying long? Yep. Mommy said we'll be here all month. Yay, cheerful. Maybe we'll have some time to talk later. All right, now that we've finished studying, what will we do for the weekend? We can play with toys, which can be yielding, lonely, and cheerful. Walk in the gardens. We can get rid of depression by attend service. Oh, we can visit Charlotte. Get depressed by visiting the tomb of my mother. Explore the castle, lonely afraid. Attend court by become more depressed. Or talk to my father. Let's go talk to my father. Dad, can we talk? I'm sorry, your uncle and I have things to do. Maybe another time. Oh. Yeah, that makes me lonely. Alright, so what, what mood are we in now? 
All right, so we're currently depressed. Here's the baseline. We, you know, going all the way up or going all the way down is never good. You want to have it somewhere in the middle. And each, as I said, each thing gives you buffs and everything like that. So, so that's how we currently are. All right, let's do, do you want to do the same? No, let's move to Royal Demeanor. Um, ba -ba -ba. Or do we want to focus on reflexes? Ooh, climbing. I don't know how that'd be good for a queen. Why don't we do... Man, this is hard. Which one to pick? Um, court manners. There we go. And we'll stick with lore in the afternoon. All right, so the week two in the morning, you're depressed to focus properly on the chapter right now. Awesome. So I got nothing. Kings and queens of Nova have all been lumens for centuries, but in modern times, magic is only used for ceremonial occasions in the direst emergencies. Well, clearly that means that my mother was a lumen. Or was she? What's that commotion outside? Father, what's going on? Juliana, I've come to pay my respects in honor of your mother. You have no respect or honor. It's because of you and your powers my wife is dead. Dun dun dun. I'm a lumen, as was she. And like every lumen, I am willing to give my life if necessary to protect our domain. Your line has been traitors for 200 years. I won't have you corrupting my daughter. That is for the crown princess to decide. Elodie, your mother trusted me, and I have much to teach you. Uh, yeah, let us see. I want to hear what she has to say. And she stays. Oh, a nice willful. King doesn't care. Let's go visit Juliana. What is it you want to teach me? First, I need to know if you have your mother's crystal. Lumen crystal? No. Oh, good. I got a success there. Success test. Royal crystal has been passed down from ruler to ruler for generations. It belongs to you now, except that the king may be keeping you from uh, Juliana has a crystal. Ooh, pretty. Light flickers above her bosom. And then with a shower of sparkles, something takes shape. You reach out to touch it and it dissolves away into nothing. Oh, it belongs to me. No one can take it from me until I die. You need to find the crystal that belongs to you. Oh, well, that was good. At least I, uh, still depressed. So we need to change our mood here, and I don't know how to do that very well. All right, clearly conversation isn't working. No. Um, yeah, I would go with faith and faith. I'm leaving Henley on faith here. I'm not really mixing it up, but I need it's, I need buffs. Learn that the gods cannot be forced to divulge information about the future, and that the most powerful ones are those which arrive unexpectedly. Long, long ago, the continent of Borealis was ruled over by a single witch king to a rival line of lumens challenged for the throne. The resulting war went on for a hundred years with powerful spells that damaged the land so badly that even now, no plants will grow. He loves me. Lottie, do you have a boyfriend? Not really. I just like to play with flowers. She's such a happy child. All of a sudden, the Duchess of Versailles rushes in the garden and points a sword at you. I don't have my feet. Princess, don't move. Um... I'm going to hold still. And I failed. <laughs> you want to hold still, but you don't have the composure to hold your position without peeking. Look down. There's a snake in the grass. Can't jump back, and the snake tends to prepare to strike. No! Cousin pushes you aside, and snake's fangs sink into her leg. Not Lottie. Too late, Juliana swings her sword and cuts off the snake's head. Oh, no. Charlotte's mother. Your daughter's been bitten by a milk viper. They're poisonous. Get an herbalist right away. I will treat my daughter. I certainly can't trust anyone here to keep her safe. I'm sorry. I don't feel good. <laughs> I'll be hurt returning home to Merva immediately. You know, Aunt has a point. Milk vipers are not native to this area. The snake should never have been here. Someone may have tried to kill you. Will Charlotte be okay? I don't know. Well, that's sad. Let's go talk to Daddy about the crystal. It's in a safe place. Can I have it? No, no, but it's mine. Meddling with magic killed your mother. I don't want that to happen to you. Once you're crown queen, I can't stop you from doing anything you want. 
but for now you are still a child. Still a child. Oh, did my mood change? I'm afraid. So what does that do? Afraid, bonus to agility and faith, penalty to royal demeanor, weapons, intrigue, and military. Well, that makes sense. Um, maybe I should work on my... No, let's work on dancing. And we'll continue with faith. Practice curtsying, standing, and walking across the floor in a graceful manner. Legend has it long ago a horde of Yveni on the back of tentacled monsters rode into the Valley of Mead, laying waste tall in their path. The conquest was only halted when a lumen raised a great flood to drown the invaders. The castle seems quieter with Charlotte and Emery and Zara and their parents gone. It's certainly not empty, though. It seems like we get more servants every day. I was so worried about Charlotte after that snake bit her. But her mother said she's okay, so I guess it turned out all right. And as you saw, I failed that test of knowing what exactly happens with with poison. Maybe she has a guardian angel. Huzzah! <laughs> um, willful and angry. Let's walk the gardens. A walk in the fresh air helps you forget the burdens on your shoulders. I'm still afraid. I think we're going to stick with this. Yeah, we're going we're gonna to stick with this. There's got to be more of faith I can learn. Practice, uh, uh, practice walking on the arm of a partner and following the cues to pause and turn while keeping your eyes closed. And practice different partner dance positions closely held at a distance and non-contact and the appropriate hand placement for each. Legend says that the island domain of Malini was once a single island instead of a cluster. So an invading Novan queen raised a terrible pillar of fire that shattered the land into pieces. Your score in lore is now 50. You may not increase this until other faith skills are 25 or higher. Okay. One of the maids approached you. My lady, Curry has arrived from the Duke of Sedna. We have a Duke of Sedna? Duchy of Sedna is in Talese. They have brought you a letter and a gift. Condolence, Diva, just wishes. Oh, what a beautiful necklace. Something sparkly would make me feel better. Mm, I failed a couple tests there. Maybe I shouldn't be focusing on what I'm focusing on. I'm not going to play with toys. I'm not talking about What really happened to Mom? She was a Lumen, a magic user. It was meant to be in reserve to defend her main, but she insisted on... You don't need to hear that. She used magic. It drained her strength. She thought it was harmless, and it wasn't. Eventually, her heart just... That's why I don't want you involved with it. Well, that's stupid. Well, maybe I should learn... Yeah, I should learn court manners. I can't learn any more of that. Maybe I should learn public speaking, royal demeanor. Yeah, we'll do that. Uh, you review the correct greetings for guests according to rank and when to extend your hand to another. All nobles accept their due honors. Practice tongue-twisting sequences of syllables to improve your enunciation. Something all of us could use. As you're walking, you spot a familiar figure in the palace gardens. It's the Duchess of Ursel. Maybe I should go and say hello. Then you notice seated beside her is a woman in the robes of a priestess. They are very close together, their hands gently touching as they speak. Hey, looks like he's busy. Turn and walk in different directions so as not to disturb them. At that moment, you notice something unusual. It looks like someone just left the pile of girls by going over the hedge. Is that a servant, a thief, or an assassin? Um, call the guards. Gods! However, by the time the response is organized directed to the area beyond the palace, there's no sign of any intruder. I wonder if you're only imagining it. Hmm... Let's go visit the dungeons. You sneak a peek at some of the luckless peasants out in the dungeons. Petty thieves and troublemakers, now suffering in the dark. They're obviously bad people, but seeing them so miserable still feels unfair. There must be a better way. Ooh, I got a new mood. Willful. Willful. Bonuses to Intrigue, Military, Lumen, which I don't have yet, and Penalty to Royal Demeanor, History, and Economics. Well, crap. I kind of... Oh, no. I was doing conversation. So let's give... What? 
Where's my buffs? Intrigue. Why don't we do... Why don't we do internal affairs and public speak? Ah, uh, court manners. And intrigue, internal affairs. Done. As the person of highest rank within the domain, no one may sit at any formal event unless you give them permission. No one must ever turn their back on you. If they do, you are intended to recognize the insult. Oh, that's good to know. So you have children of your own, your maternal uncle, the Duke of Merva, is next in line for the crown, and after him would be his daughter, your cousin Charlotte. Oh. As you're walking up the stairs, a maid comes running down holding a towering pile of linen. Before you can relax, she barrels into you, sending you in the sheet flying. Oh, my lady, I'm so sorry. These things happen. It's not a big deal. Yay! Well, at least I got that test passed. Um, so no real harm done. Please be more careful in the future. Yes, my lady, thank you. Oh, yeah, that made me thankful. Hooray! Or cheerful. Um, ba -ba -boom. Let's go see Juliana. Father says I can't have the crystal until I'm queen, so we'll just have to wait. There may not be time to wait. This world is filled with dangers, and you will need the powers of Illumina to fight them. You can't begin training until you're bonded with the crystal. What am I supposed to do about it? Crystal is probably held under guard in the royal treasury. You are the princess. You should be able to find a way inside. Otherwise, we might have to take drastic action. What drastic action? Let's hope it doesn't come to that. Try to reach the crystal. If you can't, come and talk to me again. Oh, okay. It's the willful. Public speaking now. Internal affairs. Deep breaths, practice speaking loudly. Uh, good, good. Last uh, Duke of Mead was the older half-brother of the current Duchess. His reign was brief and highly scandalous. He defied tradition to pledge himself as the lifetime life mate of the old Duke of Ursel, then broke that off only a year later. He retired into seclusion and died still unwed. Hmm, interesting. There's a man here to see you. He wishes crown funding for projects of his. Remember, the treasury is not unlimited. If you choose to invest, you'll have less money to work with later. Plan to print books using metal letter, which can be moved and reused. You borrow 875 lastly to assemble the metal. In fact, I'm gonna, oh, crap, I'm going to lose this. Uh, I don't know much about factories. We are not interested. <laughs> well, how was I supposed to know to do that? All right, let's go visit the treasury. Failed. Presents failed. They won't budge. Crap. Still willful. I think I have a penalty to royal demeanor. I do. Alright, let's let's just continue these. Memorize lists and sonnets and recite them for your teacher in any castle staff she can round up to serve as an audience. Duke of Marie has paid suit to the Duchess of Ursel to no avail. Duchess brother is opposed and he will inherit if she dies childless. Your agents suspect the Duchess of Ursel is actually more interested in the Duchess of Hellas. Neither has been linked to a man. Yeah, there's it's just all sorts of things. Ah, oh, Benyon, Duke of Marie. And what are you just talking about? Your Highness, my sympathy is very lost. Even after all these years, I sometimes forget that my own mother would ever be coming back. Thank you. Um, I must call for your aid. The Zionite occupation of the country of Imbrium has gone on for too long. Now is the time to push back. Failed for. There's been some problems with Ixion, but I don't know. I guess they're occupying Southern Marie. I don't know anything about the military. I don't want to fight. There must be a peaceful way to settle this. I will send for diplomats from Ixion to try to come to some agreement. Thank you. Let me ask that next you wearing. Where did it come from? It was a gift from the Duke of Sudna. Then you have made arrangements with him. I think he's asking if I'm engaged to the Duke. Uh, I just like jewelry, but I appreciate presents. Doesn't everyone? If you say so, Your Highness. Well, we are going to stop it here. I am going to why don't we attend court? Sitting on court sessions not fun at all, but it pleases your father. It may be important for your future. All right, so we are going to stop it right here, everyone. Uh, I hope you enjoyed this first episode. I know it's still building up to what to do, and I. If you are watching, then I'm, you may have questions. Feel free to leave them in the comments. Leave a like. Let's me know that I should keep on doing this. I've been wanting to do this series for a while, so it let me know that I'm that you want to see more of it. And if you have not yet, you can click on the red subscribe button at the end of the episode. Till next time, everyone. 
good night and good luck.